So this is a short tutorial on how to use Show Controller Tracer. Show Controller Tracer is a tool to convert JPEG pictures or bitmap pictures to vectors that can be used with lasers. So it's kind of a vectorizer program. To use it, first of all, use a JPEG picture or bitmap picture, whatever you prefer. It's always good to have a high contrast picture to make it easier for the tracer to find the edges. You can see the preview pictures on the right side. I chose a picture that is not that good in resolution and the threshold, the automatic threshold, put some speckles in here. You can see that. It's not, a, it's not a clear picture. So normally, if it's minus one on the threshold, it automatically adjusts the threshold. But in our case, it's not good enough. So we increase the threshold until we do not have these speckles anymore. Now this looks all fine. And we just hit trace. And show controller tracer automatically traces the picture. And you can see it's already pretty nice and clean. You can see it has a total points of 112 which is rather low so it's pretty easy to scan for the scanners. Make sure to normally not exceed 1000 total points as it's very difficult for scanners to handle such high point density. You can adjust if points are to be shown or not if the path to be optimized or not and different other adjustment options are down here. You could reduce the points even further but this would lead to the image not being that nice so we just leave it as it is and uh, yeah we, we could adjust the precision. We rehit trace and we get certain adjustments to this logo. If you want to use this picture, this traced picture now, um, you can use send pick to temp to send this picture to the temporary buffer. This makes it available to all software parts of Show Controller. It is also possible to save this traced image as a pick file for future use.